out at Torrey Pines today. We're gonna play a little golf at San Diego's best public golf course, in my opinion. I'm running late over right now. There was a bunch of traffic, so I'm trying to hustle it up. It's like 9 a.m. shows up at 8:55. <laughs> There's a lot of traffic. He says, yeah, yeah, we're up. good. I get up every morning and just piss excellence. <laughs> Uh, what's up, Beast? Uh, see you, Big uh, go check in. We're all good. All right. Let's check out Beast's stretching routine right here. <laughs> so. And we have JC right here, <laughs> also known as the Beast. I'm gonna try to only shank one wedge today. All right, that's good. Huh? Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa! What is that right there? Is that a golf holics hat right there? Yeah, dude, that's my hat. <laughs> oh, oh, wait, wait, wait! Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Oh, dude. What we got? Damn. And good. I love the baby hold on, blue. Hold it there. Come on, dude. You gotta I get the greenie. The oh, it's all about the, the greenie. greenie. Hang on, let me. All right, so, Beeski. I'm ready. You ready? I'm fired up. Hey, how come I don't have a golf You gotta buy one. <laughs> There's nothing free around <laughs> nothing here. Nothing free in this world. <laughs> 30 years of friendship, I gotta buy one. Family doesn't even get a discount, people. I don't know if you guys met Brian. This is Mike's older and better looking brother. <laughs> Oh, oh, look at you guys just teaming up. Why don't we play some teams then, Let's since we're it. all so frisky? I've been watching this you know? guy hitting the ball pure all the time. You guys yeah. are playing like well, four times like a week. Oh, gosh. What's up, Marco? Maybe super you want some more action today? Of course I want some action, yeah. Yeah. What, what, uh, what are you going to give me? Three. Three. You get three. I feel like that's fair, huh? <laughs> all right, maybe four. Six, six, six? Four. All right, I'll give you four. Okay. I'm getting four strokes, and then team bat, what are we gonna do, 666? 666. All right. Well, what we do is we start off with a partner, and every six holes we rotate partners, so I'll get my brother, I'll get Marco, and I'll get Justin every six holes. We play a high-low, so it's a split, so you have to play out. Um, even if you're not playing that hole well, you gotta take the high guy, and you can get up to two points a hole. Uh, usually, once we go two down, it's kind of autos, so we'll go fives. Keep it friendly. Two down auto press. Is that? Two down. What is that? Sandpiper? Oh, you know it, dude. Mmm. Mmm. It's beautiful. Love me course. some sandpiper up in Santa Barbara. Justin, I did that a few years ago. <laughs> There's literally a tee box yeah, on the beach. The like you're on the sand, <laughs> the water's rolling up probably 30 yards away from you, and you're like, it's pretty nuts. Beautiful course. Go play it. You'll love it. For you young guys out there, <laughs> the coach is gonna show you a little stretchy move right here. <laughs> <laughs> or the old guys. <laughs> Get the hamstrings going, you know, you just gotta warm them up. <laughs> oh, Dude, how what are long the odds that of that? never happens. Yeah. He was throwing a tee to see. It's gonna be a good day for me. I can Who it points feel to? It. On the bounce. Okay. Marco. All right. Me. All right, me and Beeski. That's it. All right, guys, once again, we're out at Torrey Pines, San Diego. <laughs> Probably the best public course in San Diego, in my opinion. And uh, down below, you guys are gonna find a link to a giveaway that we're doing. Don't know what it's gonna be. It might be a putter, might be something else, but uh, make sure you guys check it out and get entered. First hole here, 445 yards, par four, playing uh, straight towards the ocean. Bunkers on the right up there, each of all the ones on the left are a little bit, uh, little bit further, but uh, pretty straight ahead. You guys are gonna see some crazy long drives today. Oh, yes, sir. By this guy right yes, here. Sir. That's it. What would you say your average drive is these days? 300. 300? Every now and again. No, it's not. Every, every now and again, I have my Wheaties. <laughs> so, what do you got, Big Cat? <laughs> no stretching, no warming up. Just hit a really bad drive off the tee, but this golf course, guys, is pretty wide open. Until you get to some of the coastal holes, there's some trouble out there, but you can spray it out here. They're just thick rough. So I got about 180 yards left, a little bit of wind into me right now, and I'm gonna just hit a six iron and go straight at it. I actually got a pretty good angle, so let's see what we can do. So those trees right there are pretty high. I could never get a six iron over that, but Mr. Nicola can, so. You got over it, push it to the left a little. It's gonna be just left of the green side bunker. All right, Mike's over here to the left, just missed the fairway a tiny bit, but uh, he's got a great angle into this hole. What do you got left? It looks like those boys are already hitting trees over there. <laughs> yeah, we, we heard some trees getting knocked <laughs> right down. Right in Marco's setup, we hear this 
flank off the tree and a, I think a swear word. So <laughs> um, I got 170, a little into the wind, like Marco said. I'm going to hit a smooth seven iron and uh, middle of the green. Started off right side and it's drawn back pretty nicely. Uh, oh. Just to the left. So this hole's 450. He's got 100 yards left into the wind. That 350, and it's damp out here. It's got beats the Pulled it to the bunker on the left. All right, Marco is left of the green. He's got to carry this bunker right here. And not a ton of green to work with, so he's going to have to land it and stop it pretty quickly. Down. Oh. Okay. Greens are firm, dude. Oh, God, that was so close to being good. So. Coach kind of short-sighted himself here. He's got a touchy little bunker shot. And that's about as good as it's gonna get. That's PGA level right there. Marco had a difficult flop shot on that last hole. Greens are playing super firm right now. Run out, run out. Justin, like a cat, comes out of nowhere. Did you pull a hamstring on that? Guy might go on IR here if he keeps doing that. Boy is quick. Boy is quick. Par four, 389 yards. Playing a little bit of crosswind. You guys can see the ocean over there to the right. And, uh, but yeah, this is a pretty easy hole. Couple bunkers up there to deal with, but uh, overall not too bad. Coach is feeling good. He took the sweater off. You know, well, I'm ready. Yep. Feeling jacked up. You got his so stretches ready. in. Oh yeah, I'm good. My hammies are doing good right now. Oh. Oh, that is mama. Monster. Whoa. Mike just avoided the bunker over here somehow, some way. All right, I got 130. I got a pretty strong crosswind right to left from the ocean. So um, I'm gonna take it out the flag with my baby draw and just put it in the middle of the fairway, or <laughs> the middle of the green. <laughs> Started in the middle of the green with a little draw. And it landed on the back edge. Looks like he's on the very back left yeah. edge of the green. Ran out. Oh, just rolled off. This is le a lefty special right here. <laughs> It is, this is one of those tough shots. I got 91 yards left, hitting out of a bunker, and uh, it's really easy to chunk these types of shots. Ah. Guys, that was his drive, greenside bunker on this hole. He hit a 380 yard drive right there. So I missed the green a little bit long. I landed on the green, but it just didn't get much spin off of it. And then Mike's kind of in the same spot, just a little bit that way. Everything here slopes towards the ocean. So Mike's ball, there's a pretty big ridge that runs right in, right in the middle of uh, the screen. Tricky little chip here. Look at that. Yeah. That was a tough one. Marco's got a little downhiller here. He's gonna try to run out. Can't get too cute though, because it's sitting right on this little Mound. Chunked it. Settle. Oh, Marco learns. Had a boy partner. <laughs> All right, all right. So we're on hole three, it's a par three. It's 168 yards. This is kind of Torrey Pine's signature hole. Um, anything long is basically dead. Um, and then anything short in that bunker is, is not good either. So you can miss to the right, there's plenty of room there. And uh, that's probably where the bailout is. If you go long and left, you're pretty much in the hazard. So um, definitely uh, gotta hit a good one. Going right at it. Stay there. Yeah, it's Get right down. at it. Down, 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 down. 
All right, left side. Started down the middle with the draw. This is looking good. It's on the green. That's it. Wedge. You don't want to like a son of a Landed in the middle of the green, just kind of spun back a little bit. Started at the right side of the green Turn, with a Knock big old swooper. Swoop -a the Ocho. And middle of the green. That's it. That's Beautiful. Uh, what are you up to? How many followers you got these I gotta days? I'm going to be at like 950 something right now. I'm about to hit 1K, so if I'm not at 1K by this video, make sure you follow me. Follow Mike on Instagram, guys. Yeah, why not? Mike was right there in the middle. Justin was a little bit short. He had a pitching wedge. It just spun back hard. And uh, Brian and I were over here uh, pin seeking. But uh, see if we can make some putts here. Nice putt, good, good par. All right, so we're on hole number four. It's a par four, 488 yards. Probably one of the toughest par fours in all of San Diego. There's uh, trash all along the left-hand side, which is a hazard, and everything is into the wind. So it's probably playing about 530 yards, roughly. A bunker on the right is reachable. Um, so down the middle is a premium here. Just one of the perks of getting to play out at Torrey, guys. You get a beautiful beach view. So I pull hooked my drive right there. Totally hit it like crap. But um, I'm just gonna lay back up with the seven iron. It's in some crab grass right here, so it's not super uh, uh, sitting up for me. And I got a pretty big uh, slot, side hill lie. And uh, I'm just gonna hit a smooth seven iron. Started up the right of the fairway and drawn back. It should be perfect. All right, what do you got? Got 205 straight into the wind. Hit a great drive there, by the way. But um, you don't want to miss left. You don't want to really miss long here. So you kind of, there's a big hill right next to the screen. Everything just kicks to the left. So I want to just kick it into that, into that hill and have it bounce right next to the pin. So I think I'm going to just knock down a little hybrid. I don't think I can get there with the four iron with this wind. Right of the green, cutting just a little bit towards the pin. Be right. Oh, I think it's delicious. <laughs> what a Did shot the right there. Woo! <laughs> I missed that. I was not oh. going to do that. I was going to try to go right side of the green, but I just cut a little bit more and we'll see. I think, it worked, hot, I think it worked out good. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> sometimes you get lucky. <laughs> I think I just did. So Brian's back there. He just missed that bunker on the high side, obviously. And uh, he's going to hit his approach shot in right now. We're trying to keep the pace of play, so we're kind of moving ahead of him. Same be right. I did not see where it landed, but he felt good about it, so we'll see. Great layup by Mike, uh, just right back center of the fairway. You guys can see where he's going. The flag is tucked over on the left. Some tough uh, pin positions today so far. What do you got left? I got 110. I'm gonna swoop a gap wedge in there. Really hard right to left. Uh, pins uh, all the way back left, which is perfect for me. Uh, the wind is pretty strong, so it's probably playing about 118 right now, and I'm just gonna hit a full uh, gap wedge. Started it right side of the green and it's drawing back, but it's not going to draw back enough. But he's on the green. He's safe and he'll have a, he'll have a putt for par. <laughs> Brian's jacked up. He just hit a great shot in here. Oh! oh. Almost went in. That's somebody's putter. Oh, wow. Serious? What an asshole whoever did that. And then does it fix it? Come on, man. So while he fixes that up, I'm going to show you guys some great shots in here. Here's where Brian ended up from probably 200. What'd you have? Yeah, 190? 201, hit a four iron, 
ball was a little bit above my feet and honestly I pulled it a little bit. <laughs> I was actually aiming over here. Yep, that's where I was too. Uh, got away with it, got lucky. Great shot, dude. Thanks. So yeah, Brian's got like a little six, seven footer left here for birdie. And uh, <laughs> there's my shot. I honestly don't even know how it ended up there. It was coming in pretty hot from 200 yards and uh, yeah, you just, I'm, <laughs> I'm beyond happy with that. That is amazing. Back birdies. I don't think I've made a par on that hole in the last decade, and you just made a three. How do I've you never, feel? I've definitely never had a par on this hole, so it's been. It's usually a double, to be honest with you. So that was. Something yeah, else. did we shut him out? <laughs> Is it over? Is it over? Okay. Yeah, we're you dormy. Dormy. <laughs> and winning money. Marco's playing great right now. He's on fire. All right, par four here, 454 yards. I think it's playing a little bit less. These tees are not quite all the way back, but still, it's probably about 430. And again, we got wind coming off the right-hand side, bunkers on both sides, but this hole's going uh, a little bit to the right. You can kind of see the people over there to the right. You can see the guy in the white. That's that's going to be where we're, where we're going to end up. All right, Mike and I both found the fairway over here. We got the one-two combo. And uh, is that you or me? It's me. Marco uh, drove me by probably 12 yards. So he's happy about that right now. He's smiling. Smiling about the birdie I had on last hole still. Back-to-back yeah. -back birdies. Back-to-back. So those of you guys that have played this uh, last hole, hole number four, uh, 488 yards all into the wind, that, <laughs> that three was uh, pretty amazing. So give them a thumbs up for that. Let's hit a thousand likes for that birdie. Why not? We got 113, a uh, little downhill, a little downwind. I'm just gonna knock down a baby gap wedge. Started up off the right of the green and then drawn back. Landed pin high. Yeah, great shot, man. I got 107. I'm gonna just hit a sandwich. I do not want to go long again. Balls have been kind of bouncing on these greens and not really checking like normal, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna adjust. And I'm gonna go right at it. Let's go for three in a row. <laughs> oh, he's gonna try and bury me. I landed it near the pin and it just spun back like 20 feet. But still pretty good shot and uh, I'll have about a 30 footer. All right, we got some good shots in here. That to the left over there is Mike. He's got maybe about 20 feet, maybe a little bit less, 15 feet down the hill. And then uh, Brian, my playing partner for this first six, is right there. So we're four up. Oh nice, my God. nice and high with it. Oh, it's done. Oh gosh, I just checked up. into hole six here, par five. This one is pretty big, pretty big one. 560 yards, playing a pretty hard uh, dog look to the right. And you can see this tree, basically right where this tree is is about where the fairway starts and then the hole kind of goes over there. Oh, oh, oh. rush. Wow. Nice. Coach, oh, I got oh. a little. Nice. Oh, the old power fade. Oh. What are you thinking? I got 275. It's playing downwind. The pin's in the back. I probably need to only hit it about 230 to get there with the wind. So I think I'm going to just take a nice smooth uh, three wood and just try to get it up around the green. Mm, he hit it really good. Right at it. So just in front, but right down the middle. Hey, you got the long drive. Thanks. I got uh, Marco on that one. I play a little baby cut on him, just like he does to me all the time. I'm not even gonna shoot this. I'm gonna, I'm gonna guess about 255. I'm hitting three wood. I'm all in. <laughs> Started at the bunker on the right with a big draw. Turning towards the left. Not bad. Bunker. You can get up and down from there for birdie. Yeah, I caught a little toe and I caught it kind of fat. If you guys can see that. 
It was on a side hill lie. These two big dogs are about 20 yards in front of Mike, who was about 10 yards in front of me. Maybe even a little more. What do you boys got left? Old man power. I got 236. <laughs> uh, it's playing heavy and it's back. I don't know if I have enough juice to get a four iron back there. I got this new rescue. I kind of like it from Callaway, so uh, see if I can carve one in there. Started left of the left bunker and it's cutting. Left bunker? Yeah, I think. So Marco has basically just like a little 30 to 40 yarder to about right there. He's got plenty of green to work with. The rough looks a little thick where he's at. Oh yeah, mm. Easy shot right there. What a great shot that was. Looks like it's three, four feet from right here. All right, so Mike's got a great line in this bunker. He's just got a good ways to, go to carry it though. He's got about, he's got to pretty much go all the way across this entire green to get it up here. And uh, he's gonna probably want to fly this pretty close to the hole with some spin. There's a ridge that runs about 15 feet short of this green. So if he doesn't get up that ridge, it's probably gonna roll back. That was dirty. All right guys, we're gonna end part one right here. I'm playing out of my mind right now. I've never been <laughs> under par out here, like even for a couple holes the first time, honestly. And I think my best round on the south course has been uh, 78 or 79, somewhere around there. And that's only happened once, so I'm gonna try to keep this going. Make sure you guys check the uh, link down below. We're doing another giveaway. Uh, you gotta check the link to see what it is. It's, it's a pretty big surprise. And uh, yeah, hit a thumbs up if you guys like the video. Yeah. Grind out part two, see what we can do. And make sure you give this guy a thousand likes for uh, two under through six. This guy's playing great right now. He's totally unconscious and uh, I'm three over, so uh, you can hammer me in the comments on that too. All right guys, have a good day. Take care.